Sports with Peter Terpstra. It's tournament time. If you want to make some magic in March Madness, you're going to have to win your conference tournament. That's the case for both the Penn State men and women and the St. Francis men and women. The team with the highest seed on paper sits in Loretto. Let's head out there now. Your regular season conference champions get some gold today. Head coach Rob Krimmel earning NEC Coach of the Year honors. Junior guard Keith Braxton also earning NEC Player of the Year honors. And senior guard Jamal King goes back to back earning first team all conference as well. Talk about some nice motivation heading into their first NEC tournament game tomorrow night. It's very humbling because the honor is something that is selected by your peers. And uh, you know, at the same time, it's, it's something that I think we share with, with the staff, with the players. But uh, it was very, uh, very humbling. Oh, well, at first, definitely was thankful, you know, to be honored uh, with that kind of award. And, you know, it just shows uh, the hard work that you put in, you know, can end up uh, something good. And you know, I've been working on all off season, all this season, and it just feels good to see all the hard work pay off. It means a lot being recognized for how well I play. But individual awards is something that I look for. I think, you know, if we can go all the way and actually make it to the tournament. That would be probably one of the most, one of the better awards of my life. The top seeded St. Francis men will host number eight Bryant Wednesday night at 7 p.m. Top seed or not, as we said, the Red Flash looking to win their conference tournament to make the big dance. Season on the line. See you then. Speaking of playing for the season, the Penn State women.